This video, I'm going to show you how you can create automated email sequences, nurture campaigns, or drips as they're called in Kartra. Hi everyone, it's Kevin from Solopreneur, and I wanna show you guys how you can leverage Kartra's built-in email automation functions to create some pretty awesome campaigns, drip campaigns, nurture campaigns, upsells. These are all the kinds of campaigns you can make, and or rather the goals you may have with your email nurturing sequences. And as an entrepreneur, you know that your list and your audience is a very big part of going and running a sustainable business because these people, you want to keep constant communication with them. And in any one-to-many model, obviously you can't always have a one-on-one -on -one relationship. So email automation is super, super important. And Kartra makes this really, really easy. And I want to show you guys how to do that. Now, I want to mention that I have a video on tags and lists, uh, which is really critical to email automation. And you can learn more about how tags and lists impact email automation. Also, I have a video on how to build landing pages and I cover forms in that as well so you can understand how those are tied. So a lot of the things in Kartra sort of tie together. So I may briefly go over those concepts, but if you really want to learn more about them, I recommend you check out those videos. You know, I don't want to put all of these concepts in one video and it's going to be like an hour and a half and no one's going to want to watch it. So depending on where you are and your familiarity level with the tool, I want to separate out the topics in each video so you can watch just what you need without wasting your time. So that's what I'll say. So check out the channel for those videos if you need them. So we begin by going to my communications and then going to sequences. Then to begin creating an email sequence, we click plus sequence. Now we need to name the sequence. I'm just going to say example sequence for you guys. Now sequences, again, they're called different things. Kartra calls them sequences. Some people call them drip campaigns. Some people call them nurture flows, email automations, so many different things, right? But they're all more or less the same thing. Yes, they all mean different things, but people use them interchangeably for whatever reason. So here you enter a public description in case you want to like monetize this campaign and sell it on the Kartra marketplace. I don't care about that. So I'm just going to call it example. And you just hit create. Now, the first thing we want to do is set the starting rules. Just a little side note, if you like to look at it vertically or horizontally, you can do that. Literally makes no difference. It's just a personal preference thing. So the first thing you want to do is hit plus, And then what these are are the trigger points for your automation. In order to dispatch a marketing automation, there has to be a trigger that enrolls that person into that automation sequence. So there's many ways to do this. You could do it when someone purchases a product, when they visit a certain page, you know, they're a member of a certain list, they have a certain tag. Now again, listen tags, super powerful. Encourage you guys to check out that video if you want to learn more about how those are applied, why those are so integral to the product. I'm going to assume that you have an understanding of this in this tutorial, like I said, because I don't want to take up everyone's time here with too much information. So check out those videos. First, pause here if you want to learn more about listens and tags. Now, the more marketing 101 simplest implementation is someone fills out a specific form. That's when they qualify for the nurture. For example, they fill in your lead offer, right? Like your lead magnet. They download the free guide and now they've gotten the free guide. Now they're in your funnel so you can start sending your drip sequence so that you can upsell them on the thing that you actually want them to buy. Right, so that's the common example in a regular sales funnel and marketing 101 stuff. So let's just stick with that simple example because again, I don't wanna overwhelm everyone and I wanna show you guys the most basic implementation so that you can build on it. So you go to opt-in form and again, I'm gonna assume that you've built a landing page and a form. There's a video I have on how to do that. You can look it up on the channel as well if you need to learn more about that. So let's just say there's a simple Kartra tips here. So this is like your nurture flow. So you would just go here and you would go add. Then you would click save. Next, what would you like to happen? You can do some pretty cool stuff. Like you can see here, you can drag in a tag when someone reaches, you know, like when someone reaches this step, assign this tag. Or you can uh, send them a text message. Or you can split this and you know, you can split the sequence into two, right? And it's like you create a split here and then it's if they have this condition, you know, they have this tag, send them to this branch. Or if they have that tag, send them to that branch. Now I'm getting advanced. 
I'm not going to go through the super complex implementation. I just wanted to show you up front that that's what this section here is about, right? You can have automation splits, really complex, really advanced, cool stuff you guys can build up to. But I'm going to show you guys just the simple stuff for now. So the most common thing you're going to want to do is create an email, right? So you just drag an email in and let's just say they've just filled in this form and you want to send them this email right away, which is like your welcome email or they just downloaded, you know, they filled in your form to get the guides. So you're like, here's the guide, right? That's your first email. So you can set the time and day, the communication, you would just name this broadcast, right? Like get the th download, whatever. The gateway here you configure your gateway and you can do that in the domain settings and in the settings menu I'm gonna assume that you've done that already right this is more of a technical step and you know if you're using Kartra's built-in gateway that's fine or you can configure your own a little bit more advanced but I'm fine to use Kartra's existing gateway recipients you can again here you can segment this you can have it so that uh, you have additional conditions or if you just want to use the conditions you're inheriting from the first step, you just say anyone reaching this step, right? Because we already established who's getting it. But you again, you can do more advanced automations and change the parameters here. But we're not going to do that because we're going to keep it simple. Next, split tests. Really quickly, if you're not familiar with split testing and marketing, that is where the system can dynamically send traffic to two or three or more variants of a page or an email to see which performs better right and then you can get a lot of data this way like let's just say you want offer a or b and you want to see which gets higher open rates and all of that so again you can start to see how there's so much customization and so many advanced amazing things you can do with Kartra in terms of running a world-class marketing program but we're not going to do that. We're going to go with the simple example because that's what's going to be the most useful for most people. So we're just going to go single email and here's where we can design our email. Now, basic is just text. We can just write out an email how you would like if you just want text. Of course, if you want templates, we switch this to advanced and we go to design templates. And here you can go to full templates and you can see all of these awesome templates that you can use. Like, let's just drag one in. That's all we have to do. And just like the landing page builder, you can just click here and you can edit it. Now, I want to highlight and caution one thing for you guys. One thing I don't like about the Kartra template builder is that it does not save automatically. So if you accidentally browse away, you're going to lose all your work. So I would be very cautious when you're working within this. And once you make a few changes uh, and you enter this, what you might want to do is you might want to hit next and you might want to hit create. And then what that does is it kind of creates it already and then you can just go back into it, go to edit before you activate it and then go in there and start editing it again. So if you're building a really long complex email, it's a workaround, it's annoying that there's no save but that's kind of how it is. It's my tip to you guys but if you guys are gunslingers and you want to do it on the first go, obviously you can do that. Um, so you just go in here, you can edit it how you like. Of course, there's dynamic variables. So you can just see them right here, just copy them. So let's say you want to say, hey, you know, first name, here's your free guide. You can do that and you can use any of these ones you can have in here. So then you just hit edit to save that. And then what you do is you've, you can just check all the stuff you have in here. And then you can just go in here and you click activate. Then what you do is you just grab this and you connect these two together. Cool. And likewise, you just now can go off and you can create multiple emails. Let's say we want to clone this and we want to send a really similar email and using the same template and go in there and edit the email again. We can set the delay. We can say rather than right after the first step, we can wait one day. You don't want to over uh, communicate, right? So you just set one day. Now this email won't go out right away. It's after this person does this. And you can get super advanced, guys. Like you can set it so that, you know, only if the person has downloaded the offer and you gave them a tag or if they opened it or if they didn't. So again, so many things. Obviously, I can't cover it all, but I want to show you guys that um, this is how you build the most basic of the sequences. Let's say you want to end the sequence and you want to know who went through the whole sequence, then you could add like a tag. 
you could say add remove tag and you could say after previous step. So that means if someone got to that previous step, add tag. If you have the tag set up here, but if you don't, you can just go create a tag and create it. You can call it like finish step. Then you could say that this person has finished the step. And guys, it can get really crazy. You can go in here. Let's say you want this email only to be received by people who have opened a different email. So like, let's say you only want the people who got this, right? You can go, ha or they haven't opened. Let's say they didn't open the previous email and then you only want them to get this email. That's where you would really build out that split sequence, right? So it's like you send email A, opened email A, then sent to this branch, didn't open email A, then sent to this branch, or if they've purchased product A, but they don't have product B. Guys, this email tool, because it's integrated into Kartra and the database is shared, it is absolutely crazy, right? I mean, you can, you guys can just see here, like if we just go new automation, you can see like, look, fills in a form, subscribes to a sequence, they visited a page, they buy a product, if they refunded a product, if they played a specific video, if they completed a video, if they canceled the subscription, they partially, like guys, it's insane what you can do with Kartra because all of these tools are all tied into one. If you're just starting out with the tool, it can, you know, this can seem a little bit overwhelming, but don't worry about it. The most basic thing you're going to want to do is just someone fills in a form, send them a couple of emails. No problem. And I just showed you how to do that. But what I want to show you guys is that this is a tool that's going to grow with your business. You can do some crazy ninja level marketing, you know, upsells, downsells, cross sells, build some crazy funnels. You could have sequences that go into different sequences. So super crazy guys. I'm still even learning day after day. You can have dynamic content that only part of that email only shows when someone has a specific tag. It is crazy what you can do in the level of customization. So I encourage you guys to experiment with it and check it out. If you haven't tried Kartra already, click the link in the description to get a 14 day trial for just $1. I really recommend you play around with it and see how the email sequencing works because you want to see if that's something you're comfortable with. You want to learn more about it and see if you, th you could see yourself leveraging it. Now, the one advantage of Kartra, like I said, is unlike all the other email providers, this is integrated into all the other tools, which is game changing. If you have like, let's say you're hosting your videos in like Vimeo, that has nothing to do with your email. There's no way to trigger anything off of which people watch which video in Vimeo right? It's just not integrated. Maybe you could try and find like a Zapier plugin or something and pay or get it custom built with the API and pay out the butt, but that's not going to really help you out, right? So email is something in Kartra really worth learning and putting the time into because it's going to give you such an advantage over everyone else who's using all of these disparate tools like their landing pages and lead pages, their emails and convert kit. And then they're, you know, they're using click funnels for their funnels and all of this. And they're paying out the ass, like I said, for all of these different tools. And they're not even integrated on the data level. So this is a highly advanced tool. And yes, it's going to take you time to learn, but not as much time as learning all of these different tools and the integration headaches. Bit of a rant guys but i'm just saying really starting at 99 dollars a month with all this stuff already built in is insane it's crazy value right that's why i love Kartra. you guys know that and you know transparency i'm an affiliate so what that means is that if you click on my link and you start the trial and then you decide that it's useful for your business and you actually continue on i may get a commission so but the trial doesn't give me anything and i encourage you guys to try it out and if it doesn't make sense for your business obviously cancel but if it does you know, consider uh, learning and staying on. And the last thing I'll say is there's a lot to cover in this. So if you have any questions, drop a comment uh, and I'll try and get back to everyone. Uh, like and subscribe really helps a small channel like mine out. Um, if you want more marketing automation content, entrepreneurship, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Take care.